Hello everyone, I'm here once again and in today's video I would like to share the readings for this coming Sunday, October 20, 2024. To start with, let's have our opening prayer. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Heavenly Father, we thank you for this opportunity that you gave us the time to listen to your words, O Lord. Please send us your Holy Spirit that we may understand the readings that we're going to take up. In Jesus' name, Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. So, brothers and sisters, since we have already our opening prayer, let's proceed to the gospel reading a reading from the holy gospel according to mark glory to you O lord james and john the son of zebedee came to jesus and said to him teacher we want you to do for us whatever we ask of you he replied what do you wish me to do for you they answered him, Grant that in your glory we may sit one at your right and the other at your left. Jesus said to them, You do not know what you are asking. Can you drink the cup that I drink? Or be baptized with the baptism with which I am baptized? They said to him, We can. Jesus said to them, The cup that I drink you will drink. And with the baptism with which I am baptized, you will be baptized. But to sit at my right or at my left is not mine to give, but is for those for whom it has been prepared. When, when the ten heard this, they became indignant at James and John. Jesus summoned them and said to them, You know that those who are recognized as rulers over the Gentiles lord it over them, and their great ones make their authority over them felt. But it shall not be so among you. Rather, whoever wishes to be great among you will be your servant. Whoever wishes to be first among you will be the slave of all. For the Son of Man did not come to be served, but to serve, and to give his life as a ransom for many. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, O Lord Jesus Christ. Here, my brothers and sisters in the Holy Gospel, John and James and John approach Jesus and ask him a favor that if if if, if it's okay then they ask Jesus that in his glory uh, grant that they may sit one at the, his left and the other one at his right but Jesus told them it is not mine it is not mine to it as it is not mine to to decide it is mine it is not mine to um, it is not mine to choose who will sit at my left who will sit at my left and who will sit at my right it is for the one for those who has been prepared by my father by the by my father in heaven so it is not jesus who will choose who will choose who will be the one to sit at his right and at his left it is god the father who decide and it is uh, it is for those who has been uh, who has been prepared so um, um so 
Jesus asked them to I mean Jesus told his disciples that whoever wants to be great must be their servant so uh, whatever who wants to be the greatest of them all must be um, the must be the slave of all so I am put Jesus teach his disciples his apostles to be humble like himself he humble himself Jesus humble Jesus humble himself he served not to be served and in fact he offered he offered his life as a ransom for many to save us from our sins to redeem us from our sins amen so this is a call for all of us brothers and sisters especially in the community to serve not to be served to be humble to be a servant of all amen so brothers and sisters let's proceed to the first reading a reading from the book of the prophet Isaiah the Lord was pleased to crush him in infirmity if he gives his life as an offering for sin he shall see his descendants in a long life and the will of the Lord shall be accomplished through him because of his affliction he shall see the light in fullness of days through his suffering my servant shall justify many and their guilt he shall bear the word of the Lord thanks be to God here my brothers and sisters in the first reading prophet, prophet Isaiah prophesying Jesus as God the Father sent Jesus here in the world to uh, to as 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 offering as offering sin I mean as an offering for sin for all of us to redeem us from our sins and then brothers and sisters because of his affliction he shall see the light in fullness of days through his suffering and then brothers and sisters through that suffering he justify many he justify us and take our guilt away he bear, he jesus bear our guilt through his suffering on the cross through his death on the cross he bear our suffering so brothers and sisters let's give thanks to jesus christ that through his suffering he redeem us and all our sins are forgiven amen so brothers and sisters let's proceed to the second reading a reading from the letter to the hebrews brothers and sisters since we have a great high priest who has passed through the heavens jesus the son of god let us hold fast to our confession, for we do not have a, a high priest who is unable to sympathize with every with our weaknesses, but one who has similarly been tested in every way, yet without sin. So let us confidently approach the throne of grace to receive mercy and to find grace for timely help the word of the lord thanks be to god here my brothers and sisters in the second reading this is about jesus as our high priest who who already passed through heaven who passed through heaven who is in heaven now after his suffering here after his death on the cross he uh 
he he is already in heaven and he is our high priest and then brothers and sisters let us have uh, let us hold fast in our faith in him in our confession that he is the lord our lord jesus he is the lord jesus christ who suffered death and uh, was buried and then um and then because of his death on the cross we are saved so brothers and sisters let us approach the throne of grace to receive mercy in every time and in every time we need help amen so um, jesus have mercy on us a poor sinners amen so brothers and sisters um, uh, these are the readings for this coming sunday and i hope na may nakukuha po kayong uh, aral or idea na may dagdag po ninyo sa inyong pagdalo for this coming sunday yeah po so let's have a closing prayer in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen lord god thank you that you gave us your holy spirit na nagbigay po sa amin ng kaalaman na amin pong naintindihan ang mga salita mo na aming pinag-aralan lord god tulungan mo po kami na amin itong maisabuhay at maibahagi sa aming kapwa in jesus name amen in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen so brothers and sisters, I hope na may nakukaw po kayong aral and then na maidagdag po ninyo sa inyong pagdalo sa mass for this coming Sunday and once again God invited us all to go always in the church every, every Sunday in every Sunday as it is in His commandments make holy the day of the Lord yan po so uh, sa mga hindi pa po subscribe please subscribe po at share na rin po. Thank you for, thank you so much everyone and God bless us all. Okay, let's go. 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 